Zoltan asks, what are bulletproofs? A team of researchers has published a paper entitled Bulletproofs, Short Proofs of Confidential Transactions and More. Uh, it described bulletproofs as a new, non-interactive, zero-knowledge proof protocol with very short proofs without a trusted setup. What does it mean? How does it work? And what will be the practical benefits? Um, highly technical question. Thank you for asking me, Zoltan. Let me try to explain this as best I can. Confidential transactions is um, an invention uh, that was published three years ago that allows you to encrypt the amount in a Bitcoin transaction. And by encrypting the amount, you can break a very, very important source of um, of information leakage, where analytics companies can track amounts. Now, in an answer to a previous question, I mentioned CoinJoin, where lots of people participate together in a transaction. And one of the disadvantages of that is, if if unless you are all trading uh, approximately the same amount, it's very easy to track which input belongs to which output because of the amounts involved. So. Confidential transactions is meant to be used together with coin mixing strategies to create very, very anonymous uh, and private Bitcoin transactions, whereby no one can track who's paying what to who. And confidential transactions encrypt the value. And by encrypting the value, you can't see how much is being transacted. And if you use that together with mixing, you can't really tell which output corresponds to which input, and it makes it much more robust privacy. Now you might be thinking, okay, but if the amount is encrypted, how do we know they didn't spend money they didn't have, uh, and how do we know they didn't create new money from nothing? Um, and the technique that's used in confidential transactions is called a zero knowledge proof. And a zero knowledge proof is where you prove something is true without knowing some underlying information. Um, so, in the case of confidential transactions, what you can do is you can use um, a special type of math um, in the zero knowledge proof that allows you to add the the uh, inputs and outputs and show that they add up to zero. Uh, basically, show that the amount of the inputs and the amount of the outputs are equal and add up to zero without knowing what these amounts are. And this seems impossible and uh, trust me the math uh, when you read it doesn't make it seem any more possible it, it, it is quite confusing uh, and very difficult to understand and I don't really understand it um, but what I do understand is that if you encrypt values uh, a in the input and B in the output you can then apply a proof that says a and B cancel out each other and the the sum of them is zero. Um, so that you know that there is an equal amount of input and output, no new money has been created. The specific zero knowledge proof that is used in confidential transactions is called a range proof. And you can prove that a number is within a certain range without knowing what the number is. And bulletproofs is a development because one of the problems with non-interactive zero knowledge proofs is that they tend to be very large. They use a large amount of data. So, if um, a transaction with confidential transactions that contains these non-interactive zero-knowledge proofs could be 20 kilobytes compared to a normal transaction that's say 200 bytes, and that's uh, not a very good trade-off. So, you got a lot of privacy, but in return, the capacity of your blockchain just decreased tremendously because the transaction just became, uh, you know, a hundred times larger. So, um, what uh, the authors of that uh, paper achieved, uh, and it's a, a, a interesting read, although you might find it challenging, is they achieved a much shorter proof, so that you can prove that the numbers in the inputs and outputs are within a range without using as much uh, data, without making a very very large transaction that then reduces the capacity of your uh, blockchain. It's a very uh, incredible development in cryptography, uh, and it's once again a demonstration that Bitcoin and the and the crypto ecosystem in general and the research that's going on is pushing the boundaries of cryptography. It's generating new cryptographic knowledge and discoveries in science uh, every single day. So the practical benefits, as you asked, uh, the practical benefits is that we can get confidential transactions with much shorter proofs, which allow us to encrypt 
the value of a transaction so that we can gain greater anonymity without that transaction being enormous in size. Thank you.